everyone. Here it is again, my video blog or vlog. How are you all doing? What TV shows are you watching? There's a lot of great shows on. A lot of media call this the golden age of television, which is kind of funny when you consider that the networks are scrambling to make money and they really don't even know how to make money on the internet. And yet there's a lot of amazing shows out there, both on traditional TV and on places like Amazon and Netflix. Uh, leave a message in the comments. What is your favorite show of all time? And what is your favorite show right now? What are you watching that you really love? Not just that you like or you yeah, make sure you don't miss it, but what do you really love? What is really grabbing you right now? I watch a lot of TV. Too much. Because I have to. Well, I want to, but I have to too. And uh, one of the shows that they just came out with that I love is Bosch on Amazon. And it's really good. They have the whole first season up there. It's based on some really good books that I read. And I don't usually like shows or movies that are based on books, uh, unless it's been a really long time since I read them. But this one's really good. It's If you like detective or cop shows, it's very real and kind of gritty. but. It's not gory or anything like that, but it's just real, realistic, really good, authentic, great acting, great cast. It's just really, really good. And it's successful, so they just renewed it for a second season. So make sure you watch that. Uh, it's not free. You have to pay for it. But um, There's some really good shows coming out right now. Um, and, um, Fox has a new show out coming up called Weird Loners. It's a sitcom. And you know, I don't like a lot of the sitcoms today, um, but this one is pretty funny, and it's good. It's a good show. It's not just just a comedy, you know. It makes me laugh. It made me cry, too. I watched three episodes, and uh, it was really good, and the actors are great. And um, if you watched Ugly Betty, Betty, Becky Newton was on that. She's been on a lot of other sitcoms that didn't last nearly very long. Uh, but the guy who stars it, oh, my gosh, he's so good and good-looking, but he just does a great job. He just really grabs you and all the characters, there's four main characters and they're all really good but he just really makes the show but his relationship with her especially is really good so it's got romance and it's funny and it's a half an hour so you should check it out it starts March 31st and I got to interview the stars um, yesterday morning and they were just so funny and so nice you should definitely check it out um, there's another show out one Big Happy on NBC. I, tr I tried watching that one. It, eh, it's not that good. Sorry. I didn't enjoy it. I, I've been trying to bring myself to watch the whole episode, whole episode but it's just not very good. Um, but there are a lot of good shows out. Most of them are dramas, I have to say. And if you like sci-fi, there's a lot of good sci-fi, a lot of great comic book shows, a lot of um, really great fantasy shows. Once Upon a Time is one of my favorites. I just finished watching this week's episode and I really love it. Um, but you know this, you know all these things already. If you watch television, there's a lot of great shows. But you know, let me know which ones are your favorites and which ones are you watching right now. Uh, oh, I should be getting a Nielsen survey soon, I hope, I hope. Uh, then I can tell them how much I like the shows. <laughs> but uh, make sure you visit our site, the TV Mega site. It's a really big site. It's been around for a long time, like 20 years, which on the internet is a long time. When we first started, there weren't many TV sites. Uh, TV.com didn't exist. I think IMDB was around. It was mostly about movies. Um, not too many TV sites back then, and we, st we started it before most, before most sites did. We, we covered daytime soaps before we covered primetime. Well, we covered primetime pretty quickly, but uh, there aren't too many sites that have what we have. So we cover both daytime and prime time still extensively. And we have a lot of people who work on our site. None of us get paid. So make sure you visit and click on the ads. And that gives us money, not personally. We don't use the money for ourselves. We put it back into the site so that we can bring you more great content. And also, um, the site has daily soap recaps and transcripts and all kinds of fun things. New spoilers, just check it out. You won't be sorry. And if you have any questions, concerns, complaints, or if you just want to say, oh, I love your site, 
let me know. You can find my email address on there. You can leave a comment here. You can find me on Facebook. I'm everywhere. <laughs> so I hope you like my vlog. And I've also got a written blog as well. So check it out. Oh, and t today or tomorrow, depending on your time zone, the 25th is the last day to enter our March giveaway. We have a giveaway every week, uh, every month, sorry, uh, of DVDs mostly. We have a few books and CDs, but it's mostly DVDs, a couple t-shirts. Um, they, they give me these things to give to you guys for, you know, our site and to promote their TV shows and their movies. So enter. It doesn't cost anything. It's free. All you have to do is give me your name, address, email address, it's pretty easy and I pick two winners every single month and send it out it's amazing how many people are afraid to enter contests online you know sign up for some email address on Hotmail or somewhere and just use it to enter contests and then you know it's not that hard get a PO box you know <laughs> some contests won't let you use PO box but ours it doesn't matter so just enter the contest and we don't use your information for anything we just have to give away this stuff. I have like, you wouldn't even believe it. I have like a whole closet full of stuff to give away and I only give away two a month. So I don't know if I'm ever going to give them all away, but you get to choose of all the lists of the lists of uh, DVDs. So it's a good contest. It's not just, oh, you get some crappy thing I pick out. No, you get what you choose from the list. And it's a good list of TV shows and movies. It's not like one TV episode. You get like the whole season. So check it out and make sure you enter every month between the 5th and the 25th. And just enter now, 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 now. Because <laughs> we don't get as many entries. I don't know if people are just bored with sweepstakes or they're too suspicious or there are just too many out there. I don't know. But when I first started it years ago, um, I would get hundreds and hundreds of entries and now I get like 50 at the most so enter the odds are good they're in your favor so um, and uh, Canadians can enter too not just people in the US and a lot of contests won't let Canadians enter so make sure you enter okay that's my last thing and have a good week talk to you later bye